Matthew Ajibade died at the Chatham County Jail. He suffered from bipolar disorder, was injured, handcuffed to a chair and tased. LAPD officer shot and killed 25-year-old Ezel Ford Jr. My son was a good kid. He didn't deserve to die the way he did. Family of Tanisha Anderson maintained she would still be alive if Cleveland police had treated her as a person with mental illness as opposed to a criminal suspect. The police department had not properly trained officers on how to deal with individuals with mental illness. Two weeks after 37-year-old Natasha McKenna smiled, she was dead. You me. Law enforcement don't really have the, the proper knowledge or maybe the, the manpower to deal with people with mental illnesses. Whether we like it or not, police officers have become the first responders to mental health crisis in the neighborhood. So we were seeing like people living with mental illness were being locked up because of their mental illness. There are a series of trainings that law enforcement need that exist that are great. Uh, one is CIT, Crisis Intervention Training. This is specifically to train officers on how to identify people with mental illness, how to intervene in a way that does not escalate. You're calming the situation and trying to immediately get that person to a place of help. We want everyone trained because of the potential daily that someone's going to come across someone who's in crisis. It's not a matter of if, uh, it's a matter of how soon. When the police are trained to deal with mental health crisis and they can actually get somebody to a mental hospital is so important because if I had been diverted, I wouldn't have a felony on my record. The issues that police officers have with people who have mental illness is not unique to San Antonio. That's all over the country, all over the world. So any city that would decide to focus on this, put an emphasis on this, would certainly benefit from it. We save money, we improve public safety, and uh, people can get functional again. I mean, why wouldn't you do this? It's really a, a no-brainer.